How's it going, guys? Sheldon Roberts, golf fitness trainer out of Los Angeles, California. Today, I'm going to bring you an explosive plyometric workout. All we're going to need are dumbbells today. So focus on the lower body. We're going to do some uh, upper body movements as well, but it's all full body power from the ground up. Load and explode, create some power, create some speed, get some distance. All right. So we're going to start it out quick and easy. From here, we're going to grab our dumbbells. We're going to go into a single leg position, single leg RDL. I'll show the modified version. So we're gonna go into a row, knee drive, down, row, and knee drive. If that knee drive is much, all we're gonna do is stay in this position and row. All we're doing is getting that leg active because what we do next is gonna be pretty explosive. Just row for 10, then we're gonna switch sides, same thing, down, row, and if you have to, go into that knee drive, row, and knee drive. Perfect. Let's go for two more. One more. Good. So, we're going to drop one dumbbell. Only need one for this one. So, we're going to start with that left leg forward. We're going with the cross body to overhead position. Short, quick, compact, but explosive. So, from here, split the stance. Stance isn't that wide. Down and up, grip it across. As you can see, my right hand is on that dumbbell. My left hand just covers the right. That way we're not switching the dumbbell position in our hands. Stays there, cross body, two more, one more. Good. Switch hands, right leg goes forward, left hand holds the dumbbell. Right hand cradles over the top. Split, here we go in three, two, one. Press, drop, press. It's a slight drop into it. It's not a full squat. Just load into that side and up, good. Let's go two more. And last one, press, great. Great, great, great. Take a second, gather yourself. That should be the one that gets the heart rate really elevated, gets the legs burning a little bit. We're gonna grab that opposite dumbbell. We're gonna hold both of them. Perfect, so from here we're going into skier swings. You can see these mountains, usually covered by snow, so getting prepared for that time. Here we're gonna drop back. We're going into a hip hinge, arms just staying long. Hinge it forward and push it up, down, and drive, squeezing the glutes at the very top. It's not so much of a squat, push the hips back, feel the hamstrings, feel the glutes, and swing. More for 12 reps, let's go two more. Good, good, perfect, good. Shake out the legs, take a second, gather your breath. We're going into our next one in 10 seconds. So we're gonna have both dumbbells. I'll show the modified version. What? From here, we're gonna be releasing the dumbbell on the ground. So we're going into a squat. Release it. Jump. Down. And up. We're releasing that dumbbell on the ground through each squat. We're only going for eight reps. Explode from the ground up. Down, last one, and up. Good, perfect, great job. Ooh, that one should really get the heart rate elevated. Should feel the legs heavy, but again, we're creating power from the ground up. So we're gonna go through that two more times. This is meant to be very quick, but also explosive. So we're gonna start with that single leg row. We're gonna grab both of our dumbbells. And we're gonna get started in 10 seconds. Here we go. Take some deep breaths. Shake out the legs if you need to. And here we go in three, two, and drop. Row it. Up. Drop. And up. Good. As I said, if that knee drive is tough, legs are feeling too heavy, just stay down in that row. Still gonna feel that same burn. As I said, if that knee drive is too much, Stay in this position, 
and just row. Let's go for one more. Great. Let's switch legs. Right leg, down, row it. Right into that knee drive. Two, drive it up, maintain balance. Three, four, good. That knee drive does get heavy. Again, stay down in that row. One more, great, great. Legs should be feeling a little fatigued. That's great, shake it out. Grab one dumbbell. Let's go into that cross body to that overhead press. Push that opposite dumbbell out to the side. Let's start with our left. From here, right hand holds the dumbbell, left hand cradles. And here we go in three, two, one, drop. Two, good. One for eight, on both sides. Explosive. Three more, six, seven, one more. Great, great. Let's switch sides. Take a deep breath, gather yourself. And let's get started. Here we go. Left hand holds, right hand cradles. Let's go in three, two, one. Load and explode, good. Three. Four, five, six, two more, seven, one more, eight, good. Woo! This leg should be feeling heavy. Just know this is a good thing. As I said, power from the ground up. We know that our legs won't fill us in the golf swing. Create some power, get some distance, and get some speed. All right, here we go. Skier swings. Grab both dumbbells. We're gonna go into our hip hinge. We're starting up in three seconds. Two, one, 12 reps. Here we go. Back. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Keep pushing. Eight, nine, 10. Last two, 11, 12. Great, 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 great. Woo, oh, save the best for last. We're going into that release jump. Ah, yeah. If you need to, take an extended amount of time. That's fine, these are powerful exercises, so it should get that heart rate up. We do wanna make sure that we're prepared through each, each movement. So if you feel very fatigued at that moment, take a little bit of a longer break, not too long. You wanna keep that heart rate up, and then we're gonna go right back into it. All right, here we go. We're gonna start up in three seconds. Grab those dumbbells. Two, one. Drop them. Down. Two. Good, let's go for eight. Four. Good. Five. Good, three more. As high as you can. Push the ground away. One more. Great. Perfect, great job. Give yourself a round of applause for that one. It's well deserved. If you're laying on the floor, that's fine as well. I know this one hurts, it's tiring, but it's good. That concludes our Golf Forever Dumbbell Power Plyo Workout. So, focus on explosion. We got those legs burning. We did a lot of different things that are gonna help our golf swing, help us develop power in our swing. Give this workout a try, and I'll see you guys soon. Never miss the latest videos from your Dr. Design golf fitness experts. Subscribe now.